The ministry is still waiting for directors from President Hage Gengop on the exact date of the conference. Nyoma says his ministry is now working closely with the office of the Prime Minister to ensure the successful hosting of the conference. We are working closely with the office of the Prime Minister to make sure that uh, this land conference will be held. That, uh, this platform will provide all Namibians with the opportunity to make inputs uh, in order to make sure that we have, that we, we make sure that we have a reasonable land reform program that is acceptable to the majority of the people and also acceptable to our foreign investors and all those that are interested. In the previous strategic plan, the ministry targeted to acquire 3,1 million hectares of land. However, only 836,000 hectares of 155 farms were acquired at a cost of $1,1 billion. Despite shortcomings and challenges, as per the evaluation report, Nuyoma says his ministry managed to achieve 80% rating. The process of land acquisition and the resettlement of previously disadvantaged Namibians have been cemented with challenges and obstacles. Let us ensure that none of us are found wanting in 2018. Let us strive to reduce our turnaround times and take measures to ensure that service delivery in general is improved. The ministry formulated the new strategic plan by setting targets that could be achieved with the financial resources at their disposal. Selima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.